Okay, so we're back a bit early. For good reason. Hello there, welcome back to the channel for Club 2, episode 10 of Hall of Fame at FM23, here with Motherwell. Could this be the final video with Motherwell? I honestly do not know, because as you can see in my inbox, I've been offered the Sheffield Wednesday, I've been offered an interview for it, I should say. Now, um, uh, the previous manager was sacked about a week ago at this point, I think, and I did uh, apply for it straight away. So... <laughs> Let's see what we can do here. We are going to attend the interview, and you see, the thing is, I see this as a long-term project. I see me, if I was to get the Sheffield Wednesday job, I would stick it out. I would get them to the Premier League, maybe even get them to Europe. Now, I know it's not a road to glory, but it's something that I really like to do, and Sheffield Wednesday is a huge, huge club. Um... I've no, I've never, never had any complaints from the media. You're previously, uh, I've learned from the mistakes. I haven't, I haven't learned because, yeah. I mean, I always have a. I mean, comment section's always been nice. Yeah, I can, I can be fine in financial restrictions. I mean, just look what happened with Leicester. Yeah, that went well. I can do this. I can do this. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is a tough one. Because I actually wouldn't mind spending the entire se the rest of the season here at Motherwell. Ah, uh, you know what? No. My... Okay, so board alert, owner is looking to sell. I mean, that's always nice. Okay, so play attacking football, sign under, sign players under the age of 23, work within the wage budget, grow the club's reputation. Certainly, certainly, um, certainly want to do that. Okay, so the end of the current season, they want us to record a top half finish, so 12th or above, be competitive in the FA Cup, Papa John's Trophy, grow the club's reputation, repair the club's financial damage. Okay. Okay, that's probably not what I'm going to be doing, but um, I believe I would. How does a transfer budget of that? I mean, to be fair, that's fine. I agree, that's fine. Oh, um, let's ask for a little bit more wage budget because. I'm pretty sure they had a bigger wage budget than that when I looked, when I applied for it. Yeah, it's interesting. But currently, they are 16th in League One. 32 points. Five points clear of the relegation zone. And, I mean, looking at this, playoffs is still achievable. I mean, Scunthorpe are flying high at the minute. So, it's good to see them doing well. Have they already played Scunthorpe? Well, they've played them, got the game there, so they would have played them at home already. And they beat them 3-0. Okay, so we'll be going We'll be going to Scunthorpe should I get the Sheffield Wednesday job. Now, it's possible that this will be our final time here at Motherwell. If I get off of the job, I think I'm probably going to have to take it. This could be, I mean, the Motherwell... Stuff could be a long-term thing if I was to stick it out. But, I mean, I am enjoying it. But I just see a much bigger opportunity with Sheffield Wednesday. I think we could probably get them in the playoffs at the end of this season. I mean, we're probably going a little bit over our heads. We may even not, not even get offered it. So, um, let's see what happens. I'm taking... I would say at this point, if I was to take the Sheffield Wednesday job, I would be taking a step back. But... Taking that step back, I'd probably move a few steps forward as well, long term. So let's hit continue, and we'll see what happens. Now, at the same time, we still have a game with Hearts coming up in six days, so I don't know if we're going to hear about the Sheffield Wednesday job in that time. I am looking at transfers for Motherwell as well, so I've still got that to do. So I'll see you very soon for a possible move to Sheffield Wednesday. Okay, so I would say this is probably a good thing. Sheffield Wednesday requests backroom staff changes. Um, 
So just changes. Um, I don't really have any issues. So I'm just going to confirm as they are. So that's cool. Um, we've had a loan offer from Wigan for Leon's Foster, which we are going to reject. Uh, you, 16 year old, so yeah, you can go out and loan, why not? Um, I did actually forget to tell you that I have actually signed a player in this transfer window. George Tom uh, Thomason comes in from Celtic um, for about 50 grand, I think. 55, sorry, Mr. 5 grand. And uh, yeah, he looks a promising prospect. Uh, three star current ability, four star potential, three grand a week, which is absolutely fine. Um, Riviero has now gone, so. Um, that does leave us a little bit short in the striking department, but Mark Ferry seems to be doing a pretty good job. Um, I can't say I'd be interested in taking him with me to Sheffield Wednesday. I don't know if there's any other players I may want to take. Um, Mateus and Ho would be a good one. Maybe. I don't I don't know how these two would like like interlink with like current ability and potentials and stuff. I'd imagine it'd be roughly the same. I don't know. But um, I would say that requesting those uh, backroom changes is probably a good thing. It means they're looking at me as a potential candidate, a possible candidate, or the candidate, really. Mark Ferry's injured, but he should still be fit for the Hearts game if we're here. Nevins is going out on loan to Dons. And, yeah, I, whatever I said then, that's fine. That is absolutely fine. Oh, come on. I mean, I'd like it if I'm offered the job before. Oh, my God, they've offered me the job. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, okay, right. Let's have a look. Oh, they're offering me even less. Or is that what I said? I, I Because I thought I said I wanted more. Oh, God. Oh, I just, I mean, they're offering me, a, a, to be fair, they're offering me a lot of money. Oh, God, what do I do? Uh, I, the thing is, I really wanted this job. I know it's a step back, it, it's a step back at this point. I mean, stadium size. I mean, look at the issues we had with... FC United of Manchester and Enfield Town over the last few years here on YouTube. Uh, where we just didn't have the stadium capacity. I mean, we still won things and stuff, but, you know, we want a big stadium. We want to... Oh, guys, I've got to take it. I wanted this job a while ago, and now we've been offered it. I mean, I don't think we've done all we could do here at Motherwell, by any means, but... I think what we have done in the six months we've been here has been pretty good. You know, we've got them to the last... We've got them to the last 16 of the uh, Europa, uh, Europa Conference League. Oh, you know what? If I could do this over, I'd say I'd take the job at the end of the season. But this could be a... But this could be something special. And potential rebuild job. I mean, some of the wages are absolutely astronomical. I mean, there were big wages. I mean, this guy's out a contract at the end of the summer. We've got Vidra there, who's actually leaving as well, which is funny. Um, so, yeah. Um, I think we're going to take it. I think we're going to take it. I think we could be... I think we could have a really good time. Financial situation isn't great, but... You know my record with clubs. I could turn things around. Oh, God, this could be terrible, couldn't it? Um, right, let's start negotiations. And, um... Yeah, we'll, um... We're going to take it. We're going to take the job. We're going to take the job. Well, this has been a very short video. And, uh... Yeah, my schedule has now gone out the window. Because I... Genuinely wasn't expecting this to happen. But guys, we weren't at Motherwell for very long. But we've now left Motherwell. And we are now at Club 3 in Sheffield Wednesday. I'm not going to be doing anything else in this video. Because we will be, we will be back. Again, looking at schedule. It could be tomorrow. Or it could be... 
it could be later on in the week. I'm not I'm not hundred percent sure with schedule now, but um, yeah, um, we'll be back very soon with Club Three, Episode One, Sheffield Wednesday, and I, I'm looking forward to this. Really appreciate you watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and look forward to the incredible job we're going to be doing at Sheffield Wednesday. See you soon.